Hi everyone! Today we're going to be looking at another Liv Olive collection. Liv Olive is a UK based indie brand and she has come up with a huge collection and this is another part of it. So this consists of five nail polishes and they are all thermal. So the first image was the cold colours and now these brighter lighter colours are the warm shade. These polishes are part of a 17 piece collection called A Kind of Magic. It consists of four magnetic nail polishes, four photochromic nail polishes, five thermal polishes and four ultrachromic polishes as well. The collection is due to launch in the middle of October, so hopefully very soon, and it is just an amazing collection. There's something new for everyone. Magnetic polishes, photochromic, thermals. I'm just amazed by the amount of creativity that's gone into this collection. I have three of the four collections. The only one that I don't have to show you is the Ultra Chromics, but I have everything else. So first up, I have the polish Hocus Pocus, and this goes from a mid-toned cooler purple to a baby blue. All of the thermal polishes have a beautiful scattered holographic effect in it, as well as obviously being thermal. So the first coat is a little bit sheer. But it is really easy to apply. I really like the brushes on these Live Olive polishes. They're just perfect for my nails. As you can see, it is fully opaque in just two coats. So you can already see that it's switching to that lighter shade of blue on my ring finger. It is fully opaque in just two coats. So this is the cooler shade. As you can see, my hand is still wet. This is the warm shade. And just a moment, you'll be able to see the color in transition. So it goes from that really nice bright purple to a light baby blue. The next polish is called Slate of Hand and this is a tri-thermal polish. It goes from this really dark kind of grey blue green shade to a classic grey shade to a peach shade. So that's a kind of a big colour difference there. So the first coat is very nearly opaque. I, you could get away with just doing one coat. I am doing two coats just to deepen up that colour. You can also see that it dries quite matte, so I would recommend adding a top coat as well. And of course it has that beautiful scattered holographic effect as well. So this is the grey shade. It's a little bit lighter than what we just saw. And then it goes to the peach shade. In just a moment you'll be able to see that colour change in person as well. And here you can see all three colours on my nails at the same time. So the tip is that kind of green based dark charcoal colour. Then it goes to slightly more blue based grey and then you've got that beautiful peach colour as well. Next up I have another tri-thermal polish and this is called Secrets Whispered. And this goes from this absolutely stunning bright apple red colour, again with that scattered holographic effect. Then it goes to a slightly more raspberry toned pink and then it goes to a neon pink. It's a really beautiful colour transition as you'll be able to see in just a moment. So again, this is nearly opaque in just one coat but I am applying a second coat just to brighten up that colour a little bit. And I would recommend adding a top coat just to get it nice and glossy. As you can see, it's already raspberry pink on my index finger. So this is that beautiful, beautiful bright red shade. This is the raspberry tone shade and then it turns into this beautiful neon pink. It is like highlighter pink. I'm so amazed that that shade is just two coats. And again, here you can see all three colours on my nails. So the tip is that beautiful red, then it's got raspberry, and then it's got the neon pink. Next up, I have the shade Mystical Mayhem, and this transitions from black to blue. So in the cold state, it is black. As I'm applying it onto my nail, it looks kind of navy because it's already warming up. And then it turns into this really nice bright blue. This is most similar to the first polish that I swatched, so it's a little bit sheer on the first coat, but it does build up really nicely. Again, it dries very matte, so I would recommend adding a top coat. These polishes are all so easy to apply. I've had no issues. They're not too thick, not too thin. They're that perfect consistency where I'm not really making a mess on my nails at all, which really helps. So this is that black base. You can really see that scattered holographic effect. And now it's transitioned to warm and it's a beautiful bright blue. Mm. 
and here we've got the shade mid transition. The last polish that I have to show you is Alchemy Chic and this is a purple, kind of a warm toned purple base to a aqua. So this has the same formula as the previous one, a little bit sheer on the first coat but it does build up nicely in two coats and again it has that same scattered holographic effect. Really easy to apply formula and as you can see it's already transitioned on my nail. It is fully opaque in just two coats. So this is the cold state and then this is the warm state. And here we've got it in transition. I've got a sneaky little nail art at the end here. I've made a gradient using Mystical Mayhem alchemy chic and hocus pocus and as you can see even as a nail art as a gradient it still transitions which looks absolutely amazing it's like you're constantly in the state of changing color so that is the thermal part of the a kind of magic collection from live olive i absolutely love thermal polishes i'm completely obsessed with them it's literally like you're constantly wearing a gradient and having the thermal nail polishes as a gradient is even more epic i love how they go from really dark colors kind of wintry colors to this beautiful set of bright summery colors i think it works for every season and i literally just love playing around with them i hope that you enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next one